Can you hear stuff now? <laughs> yeah, can you hear me and the game, actually? Yes, okay, cool. Um, all right, yeah, here, hey, I'm an Audi MX. Um, here with some armor core. I'm very excited about this game. I really, I'm a big armor core fan. I'm very sad that the games have been gone for so long, but yeah, we're gonna just get into it. Uh, yep, next, next matchmaking. We're probably not gonna do any online stuff for a minute, but yeah, okay. Uh, pilot name, Max Amander. All right. Have fun ironing. Also, howdy, Digital C. Thanks for popping in. And thanks for letting me know that I was muted. We're close to Rubicon. Wake the dog up. Handler Walter verified. Activating cerebral coral control device. Augmented human, C4621, has awakened. <coughs> Time to get to work, 621. I'm powering down your entry capsule on my signal. Shouldn't we get through the atmosphere before we activate things? That's a big gun. I think I understand. <laughs> hey Rick, how's it going? Uh, I am gonna try with regular control and we'll see what happens. <laughs> Survived re entry. ISB two two six two Rubicon three complete. Your position is grid one three five. Off target, but within permissible range. There's a catapult ahead. Use it to close the gap. Okay. What have I got for equipment? Main system activating combat mode. This is not recognized that I'm using controller, love that. Okay, X is jump. Boost. Okay. Oh, toggle boost on. I see, I see, okay. Hold in space will ascend. Cool. Um, some actions consume energy. Da 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 da. Cool. Yep. How do I close this with a controller? There we go. <laughs> um, looks like uh, I've got rockets on my right shoulder. Okay, some kind of pistol, laser sword, no left shoulder. Cool, okay. Let's go. Okay, so boosting seems to be free when you're on the ground. Critical artery tag targets uh, on screen enemies. When there are multiple enemies, enemy closes and sends the screen will be prioritized. Move the camera to change priority target. Cool. Clear off those guard mechs. Perfect chance to test your AC. Uh, cool. Lock on of these missiles to just go and boom, boom. Love it. Target assist your AC oriented towards the target. When enabled, your AC uh, da, 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 target assist mode. I might need to see what that button is. <laughs> uh, controller target assist mode is R3. Okay, cool. 
cool. Missile launcher. Uh, yep, yeah, already figured out the missile launcher. Ooh, don't go off the cliff. Nope, it's be real time. I'm gonna, oh god, not fall off a cliff. <laughs> cool. I'm gonna uh, access. What is access? Triangle. Cool. Okay. Uh, do, 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 do. Use repair kits, repair AC. I can use it three times in rapid possession. Okay, I don't. Making me look at the controls again. I see. Uh, do repair kit is up. Okay. Two repair kits remaining. Cool. See the contaminated city down there. That's where you're landing. Access the catapult. Gotcha. That boost is okay. Okay, so circle boost. Was that an enemy? No, just a, just that. Okay, cool. Uh, do I just go? No, I do not. This is definitely a catapult. Oh, maybe I need to stand. Yeah, I need to stay. <laughs> Whoops. Okay. Cool, cool. All right, let's go for a ride. <clears throat> hey, Vert, how's it going? Um, yep, this is this is EDF. You got it. <laughs> Time to fly, six, two, one. If we get our hands Yo, big on ass robots, robots are the best. Where my uh, quick boost, certain direction, if I attacks. Okay, I should see what that is. Quick boost is oh, is square, which is what I was doing before. That's just the chunk boost. Okay. Yes. Oh god, coughing is going to be hard. Okay, that needs a slight cooldown. Okay, cool. Um, is there a way to see... Okay, left side of the reticle is my cooldown for that. Uh, do, 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 right shoulder, cannot, uh, okay, salt boost, uh, okay, how do I salt boost, the fact that this doesn't have the, salt boost left, L3, L3. okay, cool. Picking up signals from AC Rex. I guess I'll hit the one on the right first. Oh, I'm out. Did you hear anything about what the corpse are up to? We're being attacked! Unidentified AC! Return fire! Okay. 
there's a lot going on screen to maintain focus on here. Just saying that real quick. So I'm going to be not amazing with chat, but I'm going to try my best. <laughs> Lots of guns. I am very much afraid I'm going to run out of ammo. Mission. Yeah, just keep blasting. Yup. Get sorted, fool. Monkey Gordo, licensed to uh, AC Rec in Contaminated City, can use pilot registration data, registration RB37, Monkey Gordo, affiliate independent, license expires in 15 days. It's still valid, but the pilot's rank is no good. We can't use this. Boo. Head to the next wreck. I'm gonna try not to fight everyone along the way this time. Let's see if that's not happening. <laughs> This area, so that might make my life easier. Cool. Analyzing. Uh, G7 Harka. Hack Hakra? Hakra. Let's go to extract from AC Rack, Contaminated City, Community Palace Registration Data, Registration are RB29, Call Sign, Rank D, Affiliation Balam Industries, this inspires in 12 hours. Corp license, easily traced. Forget it. Okay. Looks like they've got shields. Good thing you've got a blade. Let's see about this license. 
What if I just ignore them and uh, hack this license real quick? Thomas Kirk, uh, RB18 uh, Thomas Kirk, rank 26E affiliation independent, license expired. Sorted, you fool. And then blast it. I do have to say, this game feels very good. I don't know how, like, visually this comes across, but it feels. <laughs> yeah, full on. Um, it feels very good to play. Nope, not the one I meant to go after. Okay. Um, how do I manually reload? That's a question. Uh, da 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 da. Nothing about that. I don't want to purge weapons. I don't want to repair. Option R? Let me see what option R is. Doesn't seem to do anything. I might also be fully... Um... Oh, come on, come on. Can I make that? It's a catapult. Yeah, great. I just... Yes, yes. Cool. One, two, three. Go. Go. Oh, I think... Aha! Uh, what was repair again? I'm gonna repair before this. This feels like a boss fight. One repair kit remaining. Cool. <clears throat> and I don't know if I can use those in fight or not. Registration number RB23. Rank fits the bill. Call sign. What? Looks like they were on to you after all. Oh god, I need to like pay attention to the missiles. Oh god, I'm taking so much damage. Okay, don't get hit like that. God damn it. AP at 30%. Oh my god, I'm doing no damage. I am bad. Oh, jeez. Alright. <laughs> uh, yes, restart from checkpoint. Yes. I don't know where the checkpoint is. <laughs> Please just be at the beginning of this fight. We'll find out. All right, cool. Try accessing the rack. Uh, thank you, Vert. Take a drink of water before we start. Registration number RB twenty three. Rank fifth. Where the hell did they come in from? Call sign. There they are. What? Looks like they were on to you after all. No mood to pick a fight with the PCA. But it doesn't matter. Take it out now, they won't have enough to ID you.
Right, air. Okay. Yeah, real quick. Nope, that's not what I meant to do. Oh, he's outside the thing. God damn. I'm trying my best. I can do this, I can do this. It was not so bad once I got the, uh, whatever it's called, the like, when I broke its poise, basically. I also used a heal way earlier than I needed to there. Cool, okay. Okay. She's almost always gone. There it is. Unloading. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. Exclusive exit blast radius. Even if you dodge initial hit, you get caught by the blaster on the ground. In these aerial maneuvers. Okay, so I just need to be in the air more. In the sky.
God damn it, they're outside the thing again. Where the fuck did you go? Where the fuck did you go? <laughs> Staying in the air more. Staying in the air is good. I'm lasting longer when I stay in the air. I need to pay attention to those rockets so I can boost out of them more. That's it. Try accessing the rack. The fact that I haven't been able to use my sword kinda sucks, but is not a huge deal. Registration number RB23. Rank fits the bill. <laughs> it's just the Gunder. Yes, true, true. That's bad. So close, so close. Oh, yes. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Bye bye. Confirmed. Heavy combat helicopter is down. That's all for our work here today, 621. <laughs> Thanks, Digital C. License code Raven. Uh, rank F. Affiliation independent. License expires in three days. Registration. Da da da. Cool. Raven. That's your new name here on Rubicon. Uh, probably about on par with normal from soft losses. The like remembering that I need to be in the air is like the thing that took some time to get used to, but yeah, not not terrible. 
I think Unix, uh, Unix Gunder, how you pronounce his name, I had harder trouble with in Dark Souls 3. For a time, coral was a revolutionary energy resource and data conduit, poised to transform human society by leaps and bounds. They called it the fires of Ibis, <gasps> yes. a storm of flame that tore through the stars, leaving lethal contamination in its wake. Coral, the kindling, was thought to have been utterly consumed, forever lost. However, on Rubicon, the embers continued to burn. <gasps> the embers. It's Dark Souls. Humanity would inevitably return. To stoke the fire. <laughs> cool. Call me Raven. It's my new name. This notification follows restoral of access privileges. All Mind provides a combat training simulator to support its mercenaries. Your license was in a suspended state. Perhaps you may need a refresher. Cool. As an added incentive, completion of the exercises will be rewarded with AC parts. Love it. You stand to benefit regardless. Cool. <laughs> Thanks, All Mind. Appreciate it. Following feature is now available. Sorty. AC design, cool. We got some emblems. Data acquired Tenderfoot. I'm assuming these are the pre order bonus things. They just gave you some mech parts for pre ordering. Uh, AC design, assembly. Okay. Quest AC assemble, uh, assembly using the parts you have available in the assembly menu. What is assembling AC? Da, da, da. Cool, cool. Um, okay, so we want a back unit, which we don't have yet. Let's look at the body parts that we have that we could switch up. Okay, so much higher AP and uh, system recovery is lower. Weight is decently higher. EN load is higher. But all within. Boost speed is comparable, like basically the same. Agility, AV goes on by about 300. I mean, it's a head, so that makes sense. That doesn't change that much with that. Um, core phrases, which are red, uh, okay. Uh, generator output goes down a little bit, but that's fine. Our weight goes up a, quite a bit. And load is still fine. So we're all within parameters. But also, we gotta look at style. Style is important when making a robot. Um, do, 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 do. Okay, so these are these are basically comparable parts. They're just slightly firearm specialization. Interesting. Uh, there we go. More info. So many numbers. Arm load limit goes down with these arms. Okay. We've got no expansion slots. We've got, okay, so paint. Painting is important. What color sets? We're just gonna go with the color set for now. And then we will futz with it later. Ooh, I like bright colors. <laughs> These are ridiculous. Uh, we're just gonna go, uh, do we go with yellow? Yellow is cool. Uh, ah, the 
purples are good too. We're gonna. Oh, wait, 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 what was that? What was that? It was military. The white and blue military. We're gonna. Uh, no, we're gonna go with that yellow. That yellow was fun. And. Do, 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 do. Okay, good enough color choice for now. Let's see, it's cool. Decals, yes. Uh, what's our logo gonna be? People have thoughts on a logo? Oh, I guess we should go with Raven, because we are Raven. Um, can you put an anime girl on your robot? Uh, great question. I may not be able to yet. But yes, I should be able to. Uh, wait, what kitty? This one? <laughs> uh, downloaded, yes, definitely can. <laughs> Put anime girls on here. Um, custom decal layers. Ooh, okay. I'm not gonna futz with all of this. For now, okay. We've got a cat on our centerpiece. We've got the raven on our head. Uh, da, 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 da. We're gonna actually, I don't want it to be centered like that. I don't know. Wait, decal. Uh, here we go. Okay, okay, it's gonna be on our, the, si the cat will be on our side here. Um, how do I make it slightly smaller? Actually, this is probably that's fine. All right here we go. Uh, size. There we go. Cool. Cat goes on our right arm. Our core is not gonna have the cat. Sorry. Um, you are. How do I get rid of that? Um. What, how, how do I remove, there we go, okay. All right, we've got the cat on our right arm, we've got the raven on our head. I uh, gotta put the spider, right from copy from Hanaki Star Rail. I don't know anything about Hanaki Star Rail, but I'll put a spider on our leg. Right there, real, real tiny spider. <laughs> Image editor. Okay, this is how I could get anime girls. Not gonna do that right now. Um, easy data, interesting, okay. Um, so I can, do I have any other weapons? No, this is it. So I could, okay, so I can mess with the parts that they gave me for the pre, uh, whatever it is, but can't really fuck with my design that much. So we're going to the training. What about I say? Uh, basic controls, cool. Um, and hopefully we can get some access to like weapons and things, because I'd like to futz with that. And obviously that there's a lot to futz with in that. Okay, land shots move uh, enemies. You must pull the trigger when they are in lock on range. Where targeted tracing is active. Magazines will automatically reload when the magazine image is depleted. Manually reload uh, before engaging in the minutes for risk of attacks. How do I reload? I don't. I. Employee device. There we go. Thank you. Triangle R2. Cool, okay. Uh, to use missiles and other homing rounds, keep the enemy on screen, lock on complete, then fires missiles. Right shoulder, hold, multi lock on, triangle to cancel it, okay. Cool. 
No pin, so click the left hand, card, da, da, da. yeah. Oh, hold it to do a charge attack, okay. Cool. Cool, okay, okay. I was thinking they were all just single hits, but that is not the case. Uh, you can scan by pressing down to show you where enemies are. Cool. Ooh. Sick, got a gun. Okay, cool. Um, let's, any other? Okay, just basic training. EC test, no. But let's, let's see how this gun. Attack power is a lot lower, its weight is better, its energy load is better. Uh, it's basically an SMG. Um, Oh, the recoil is better. Ideal range is much closer. Effective range is. Uh, do, 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 do. Can't store it in my back. And it's not, it's only a right handed weapon. Okay. Or oh, it's a machine gun instead of an AR. Uh, da, 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 da. I think I'll keep the AR for now. Glad I got that though. Right, missions. Uh, chicken killing jobs and sorting missions for missions mini complete missions to suppress the story. Um, and then I've got replay missions to achieve S ranking. Cool. Uh, neat. Okay. Contaminated city. Destroy targets. Um, this one's worth a lot more money. Straight Rubicon, Liberation Front Artillery. Installation is extra lord based on number of enemies destroyed. Mob of dif uh, Dafang, MT squads deployed in grid 135. Cool, all right, destroy squads or destroy targets. Let's go with the targets because it pays better. Got a job for you, 621. This is an open call from the Balaam group. One of Balaam? the corporate forces occupying Rubicon. Attention all independent mercenaries. This request comes from our affiliate, Dafang. The Rubicon Liberation Front has deployed Baos artillery throughout the contaminated city. The city itself has no strategic value. We cannot allow them to hinder expansion of the Coral Survey. <laughs> Show us your ambition. Destroy the Liberation Front's artillery. Okay. Bonus pay will be awarded for destroying their MTs. We want the enemy weakened. Consider it an opportunity to prove yourself. Impress us, mercenaries! Cool, cool, cool. Uh, do, 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 AC data. Gotcha. So if I, okay, so I can do preloaded uh, ACs to come into here. All right, let's just go. <clears throat> How's everyone doing tonight, by the way? Anyone else picked up Armor Core slash looking to play it now? Or are people just checking it out through through my eyes? Because I am having a very good time so far. Destroy all of the Rubicon Liberation Front's artillery placements. Let's go. 
Oh jeez. Ow. Let's just heal real quick. <laughs> Hit a lot. to do go wait a minute for the PS5 release oh damn yeah I am very grateful that PC got the earlier release window maybe it eventually does look kind of big brain for me instead I gotta wait for Starfield after I finish BG3 I don't know if it's um, ammunition cost, repair costs, expenses, bonus pay covered my expenses. Fuck yeah. Um, there is a lot going on, but it's not. I definitely I would recommend playing this with a controller though. Like, um, but it doesn't it doesn't feel unreasonable. This is a notification from All Might, the mercenary support system. But it's still early in the game, so what do I know? Fuck yes, I can buy shit. <clears throat> yeah, because I 
update and training. What we got to buy? Okay, sell. Cool. Okay, because I can sell that part I just got. Everything else is unsellable. Good to know. Uh, we're just reducing by the menu. Okay. Uh, so we got a burst rifle, burst rifles, da, 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 consumes kinetic ammunition to deliver reliable offensive potential. But there's no damage and impact, can be charged to fire burst shots. A handgun. A bazooka! I might go with the bazooka because bazookas are fun. Alright, left hand. Same guns, but we have to buy left hand versions of them. Okay, for our left back unit, standard pulse shield, help, da, da, da. so we can get a shield. More missiles. Do sell dual missile launcher, da, 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 da. traps target and pincer trajectory, limiting evasive options, models that are used with lightweight builds, capable from multi lock. Um, more info. Okay, so the difference between these two missile launchers. Attack power is higher on the second one. Impact is higher. And okay, so attack stats are all generally higher. Guidance is worse. Effective range is much lower. Humming lock on. Max lock count is only two instead of four. Rounds are comparable. Ammunition costs. They're a little bit cheaper to buy. Um, they lower my altitude recovery. Uh, yes, they do have a plot. Um, says it isn't big brain pulls a screen that is an Excel spreadsheet. <laughs> I mean, the numbers are pretty straightforward. Blue is good, red is bad, but also like the reason that these are red is because I have no blue, so everything that is white is actually blue because. I'm adding a new weapon to my set. I think I'm just gonna go with this. I'll go with the, mm, I don't want a shield. I'm gonna go with this new um, back piece. Um, for leg types, we've got bipedal, bipedal, bipedal. Although some of these look like they might be reverse jointed. Yes, reverse jointed. Okay, we got some booster options. A generator. Do, 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 do. Capacity's down. Recharge is a lot better. Supply recharge is a lot better. Da, 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 da. A little bit heavier. Recharge delays lower. Da, da, da. Interesting. Okay. Um. <clears throat> Uh, but yes, the, I mean, I still don't have any idea what's going on with the plot so far besides I got airdropped in here and I'm doing missions for, was his name Walter? Walther? Crap, what was his name? <laughs> um, this is only my third Armored Core game, um, which, so the, my memory of the plots is probably not the best because of that, um. Let's add in training, kind of fundamentals. Here, da, 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 da. All my pilot training. And also like this this game is a fully new plot. I don't think it's linked to any of the previous games. Um, sometimes they do have like plots that go go between like, um, like Armor Core 1 and then Master of the Arena, I think is the second one. Like those immediately follow each other. And like the two that I've played are Silent Line and Last Raven, which I don't think had any link between them, but also were like, a, a jump in like number of games between them. Uh, you're supposed to stop some organization with liberation in the title, which makes me begin to suspect you might be one of the bad guys. I mean, who we're in it to make money right now. That's all I know. I know that I'm a brain dead merc or a brain dead dog or something, and he's got my back. My handler's got my back. Someone's going to be charge attacks, R2 to use right hand, hold it to charge it, triangle to cancel. Cool, that missed. Okay. The ACS attitude control system of a craft can be comprised by a community straight from impact repeated attacks. ACS Overloads results in a vulnerable state called stagger, in which time affected craft can be mobilized and uh, hold R2 to charge right hand and, and 
L2 to use left hit one there. Direct hits. Uh, direct, during staggers, all incoming damage is directed to direct hits. Deal much more damage. Right, still too far away for that. That's a shield. Use my missiles. Ooh, you're still alive. AC strain effect on enemies resets after a brief interval, but a portion of the strain will remain. Weapons vary amount of strain they inflict an explosive impact, generally leaving most ACS strain. So like a single hit there looks like it does a big old chunk of strain. But then missile. Oop, okay. Hex enemies that are unaware of your presence with a greater ACS strain. You da -da -da -da. Shields could be on the left shoulder, can be deployed. But it goes down as soon as you use other things. Shield put is maximized for one to two seconds after deployment, blocking your initial guard. Cool. I don't want to deal with shields. <laughs> That's a very short window for timing. Do not boost rush attacks, small arms that can be used during movement, which inflict great impact. Uh, assault boost, use right hand weapon, use the. Okay. because you get in their face and fuck them up. Cool, 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 cool. <coughs> we got the Curtis. What is the Curtis? Uh, no, no, no. Uh, AC design, assembly. Did not equip that. <laughs> Assemble an AC, great, okay. Uh, it's a linear rifle. Sally Browns. Oh, okay, this is this gun. Okay. <clears throat> Attack power impact. Direct adjustment. It's able to be charged. Okay. I think I'm good with that for now. I don't have a ton of money. Need a lot more to get new core. Oh my god, this core is hideous and I love it. <laughs> uh, okay. Arms, same deal if I just need more money. Are these boosters worth? These boosters look a lot. Okay, jet duration is a little bit lower. Ink consumption is a little bit lower. Upgrade oh, earring my weight goes up, but I'm still in the weight limit. My energy limit's fine. These are just better boosters. Like, that's... I'm still within the weight limit. Like, I'm not... 
not concerned at all. <clears throat> um, I do want to test that out real quick, though. <coughs> Just to be certain that my reading of these numbers is not very wrong. <laughs> Uh, yep. Okay. I'm Superman. Uh, sure. Cool. I just barely killed that thing. <laughs> Alright. Quit test. <clears throat> Alright, let's sort you into the next mission. Oh, okay. I can get more money from just doing these missions again. Good to know. Missions. Okay, so... Eliminate enemy squads. This is the other mission that I had open. Okay, cool. So it looks like I didn't miss a mission for choosing one of those two so far. But that could happen one. later. It's an open call from the Archibus group, one of the extraplanetary corporate forces. To all independent mercenaries, this request comes from Schneider of the Archibus group. The operation will take place in grid 135, Southern Bellius. Your objective is to destroy an MT squad sent by Dafung, a Balaam company, and a competitor. Grid 135 is a key foothold in Archibus's efforts to conduct a coral survey in the contaminated city. You, okay. the independent mercenaries, are the key to maintaining our lead in the coral survey race. The Archibus group looks forward to news of your success. Wow, well, no one even knows that it's really... Hunting. If there's enough to use here, this is all just surveys, and we're fucking up so many people. Uh, love it. <clears throat> love Megacorps just fucking around. You've got ID. Now you need a rep. <coughs> Get their attention, 621. Okay. Okay, this is yeah. This is where we dropped in originally. Just gonna explore a little bit while we're here. Cool. the Vespers. I wonder who that is. Archibald. 
was triangle. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> Interesting. That was a very, very short mission. Don't hate it, though. Oh, is that a passageway? Ooh. Maybe there's some goodies up there. <coughs> cool. Hey drones, how's it going? How was your nap? All night will reward you with parts based on the number of submissions you provide. Cool. You've already joined Log Hunt, one of All Mind's mercenary support programs. Discover and destroy targets marked with the Log Hunt target icon to obtain combat logs for submission. Collect combat logs to improve your hunter class and receive reward parts from All Mind. Cool. All right. Don't hate that. Hunter class zero zero. All right. Um, it's going really well. I'm really enjoying the game so far. Um, there's lots of numbers on screens, which I love. <laughs> um, let's see, anything new in the part shop? The game is definitely, uh, I'm bad at it. Like, decently bad at it, but it's a lot of fun. <laughs> <clears throat> Anti-explosive defense goes up. I don't need anti-explosive head. That's fine. Scan effect goes up. Uh, and I still am poor. Cool. I'll just sort again. Uh, destroy transport helicopters. Destroy all Rubicon Liberation Front logistic helicopters. Extra work based on number of enemies destroyed. Destroy Living Core enemies test AC. Uh, yeah, let's destroy helicopters. Numbers on screens bad at a game, but still fun. It's me playing your up already on universe. Uh, yep. <laughs> exactly like that. Raven, this request comes from Dafa, one of our affiliates. The group has committed to use of military force to handle the Rubicon Liberation Front. The target for this mission is a squad of transport choppers. Destroy mm -hmm. them. Counter guerrilla resistance from Baus mass produced MTs. They're no great concern. Okay. You performed adequately in your last sortie, Raven. This did not go unnoticed. We will be watching with interest to see what you bring to the team. Cool. Um, hopefully, I'll get some more money and can buy some more parts so you can see me having fun with numbers on screens. Because, like, I don't have enough money to buy these parts yet, but I want to start investigating them more. <laughs> uh, although I did forget I have a different head, right? That... Uh, I'm going to stick with my body for now. I think that that's fine. Yeah, let's just do it. <clears throat> now they're asking for you by name. Destroy the Rubicon Liberation. 
Operation Front Transport Choppers. Ooh, nope, a little higher. with you what oh geez he's got melee too Wow, okay. <laughs> I see what you mean by ignore it. <laughs> uh, restart from checkpoint. Gotta record a cover of Piling Moons. Padam, padam, but make it balam, 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 balam. I see it now, balam, balam. Nobody's gonna make it now. <laughs> uh, oh, I just have to restart the mission. Okay. <clears throat> Do I get? Oh darn! I see if I could get. Uh, do I get more money for destroying these people, or if I should just ignore them? I don't remember. Strider. Okay. Bye. <laughs> okay, so I do get bonus pay from destroying them, but also that bonus pay barely covered my expenses. Oh, the light MTs are worth a decent amount. Okay. 
I probably would have gotten a lot more for destroying the big guy, but... That's fine. One, two, three. I see your back, 621. The corpse see the Liberation Front as a hindrance to expanding their coral survey. But to the Rubiconians, your actions are only helping the corpse with their invasion. It's just a job, 621. All of it. All right, part shop. Anything new in the shop? Yo, maybe I should just get a bazooka. Uh, I can almost afford some new legs, though. No, I'm saving up for legs. That's what I'm doing. I'm sticking with it. Let's try the test tray, see. Cool, okay. fight than the things I've been fighting so far. I love that. <laughs> okay. Main system activating combat mode. Commence mission. We've got a read on the target. Now's the time, 621. The place I just blew up. Maybe? No, it's not. It's similar, though. No, we can't go that way. Fine. Let me explore. Let me be free. Oh, wow, that's far away. Only I can do melee. Leave me alone. Alright, dude. You don't get that today. Oh, sorry. Okay. I'm glad you finished ironing Digital C. Oh, thank you for the sub. Wow. 35 months. Wow. <laughs> Can't hear the sub alert over the mech combat. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
This game, ooh, lock on program, okay. It really consumes all of your attention when you're fighting. <laughs> Sounds like we get allies. I'm curious how. I mean, the enemy AI has been pretty solid, so I'm assuming that the uh, ally AI will be good too. Six two one. About the tester AC you downed. That was being shipped to the Red Guns, Balaam's in-house AC squad. They're Balaam's main force, and its members are no amateurs. Remember who you're messing with. Okay. Uh, no, this is assembly. I want part shop. I want to buy things. My new arms. I still can't afford new legs. Close, though. Look at these chonky legs. I could be a bulldozer, but with legs. <laughs> Take the damn complex. I can move by friendly craft. Cool. Destroy all generators. Destroy weaponized. Destroy. Oh, the strider. Okay. Cool. We're gonna do the dam first. Can you customize your mech color? Why'd you choose yellow? Yes, you can customize your mech color, and I chose yellow because it was one of the like preset color palettes that looked very good. I did realize it looked like Bumblebee after I made it, and then I ignored that because I don't care about Transformers. <laughs> It's also on brand color because it looks like lemon meringue pie. That's the real reason I chose yellow. I'll be sending two good for nothing maggots from the red guns. Gun four Volta and gun five Iguasu. You? You're just gonna be tagging along on ass wiping duty. Ooh, rude. I'm assigning you the call sign gun thirteen. A lucky little number that just became available. Gun thirteen sound off! Good enough. Now go get ready! We're going on a field trip, kiddo! <laughs> All right, let's go. Gun 13, huh? I'll stick with 621. Don't let the red guns teach you bad manners. We need a gun shooting sound alert so you can play it when your cross line is set. Missiles at? Oh, we need to destroy this thing. Boom, boom. Hey, freelancer. But no one even told you why we're here. Well, as a free red gun to kind of climb the wall. This is just target practice. Done. All this little face is next. Good fire. Can't take yourself away from chatting on the tagline. Why don't you start a sewing club together and stitch that damn mouth of yours shut? Wow. Shape up or ship out! That 
takes care of the frontline MTs. That was just a warm up. Look alive, maggots! Two generators to go. Keep moving, Ooh, that's something scary, look. Hope you're enjoying the field trip, kid. Don't wet your pants now. <laughs> Does this guy ever shut up? Eh, he made a pun on AC. I mean, sir, I do agree with you, but also, they give me giant robots. Cool. Looks like my good for nothing's were good for something after all. Field trip's over. Got 13. I'll keep that lucky call sign open for you. Uh, da -da -da -da. would directly contact for <laughs> answer my power. What sorts of air horns or pew pew lasers? <laughs> uh, cool. Nice. <clears throat> yeah, it was be real time like literally as I started streaming and I I did not I did not click it. <laughs> you got lucky, Merc. I guess I'll do it now though. You were the only warm body they could find. The Smile guns everyone. Are going to be first over the wall. Have fun watching from the sidelines. All right, parts shop. No new parts. Sortie. The mining ship. Let's go kill the Strider. Got a job for you, six two. Yeah, I've been bad about Be Real recently, mostly because I've been sick and haven't wanted to deal. <laughs> this request comes from Schneider, an Archivist subsidiary. The mission will take place in the Bonadea dunes of Western Bellius. Our coral investigation there is being blocked by the Strider, a Rubicon Liberation Front mining ship. You 
hard to destroy it. Okay. I like destroying big things. Resource base that was extensively weaponized by the Liberation Front. Call it the crowning glory of their efforts to militarize into an anti-corporate force. Your attack will focus on the eye, a giant laser cannon connected directly to the main generator. Okay. It's protected by a shield, which is powered by auxiliary subgenerators. These should be your first targets. This concludes the briefing. Good luck. No. Yeah. It's a digger with a big laser. Love it. Time for a little self promotion, six two one. Uh yes, we are one hundred percent a pro corporate force. We are a mercenary working for corporations, fighting each other. It's yep. World sucks in this game. Who knows, maybe we'll tear down all the corporations in the end. We'll find out. That's a laser. Alright, I'm going closer, faster. That was a big old powerful laser. Jeez, go! Oh my god. Jeez, this is big. underneath it probably all right now we've got a foothold to get on the deck grab on and get to work on the sub generators uh, how do I fly up that high uh what <laughs> Oh, I can probably use the legs to climb up. I'll try that. That, like, chunk there. Let me see if you that. will give me some height. Oh, well, or I just can fall the whole way. God, no, just missed it. No, all the way down. God damn it. Okay. Can I, like, super boost up there, maybe? Yeah, okay, super boost. You can fly along, but ow. Defend the 
No, no, no. Oh my god, the eye. They shot it at themselves. He's gonna hit me. Leave me be. All sub generators destroyed. Oh no, I missed. The oh god. Is Head to the front segment and hit the target. I fell down. Oh, thank you. Jeez. Shoot again, then I can get up close and fuck it out. Now you've got the target in your sights. Time to finish this six to one. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. No, 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 no. Please leave me alone. Any clear on that side? Oh. I'm doing my best. I jumped off to the wrong side. I'm sorry. The Radon fight. I mean, kind of. A mercenary independent contractor fighting for a voiceless corporation or a Twitch streamer. <laughs> uh, repeat of the EDF Iron Man where you brought you the wrong loadout. Uh, I just don't have access to loadouts to really quite yet. Fuck off. I hear you're deploying V1 again. 
must be rough only having one good pilot to rely on. Oh? Are you suggesting your dog can take Freud's place? You'll see. Just give us the chance. Very well, then. We're also deploying V4. Who's been equally brazen of late? Let's see how they both perform. Please just start reminding me of the arrows run up to Radon. Yeah, very much so. Although, a lot harder to not get hit by. <laughs> Hey Jeffy, thanks for the sub. At your service. I think I'll enjoy doing business with you. You should see any training. Cool. New parts. Let's go. Okay, part shop. What can I buy? We've got a laser rifle. All right. Cool. Uh, a plasma rifle. Okay. Uh, same for the other hand. Uh, laser cannon. Ooh, okay. Laser cannon, uh, large version of the standard laser rifle. Rematch is a back match of my own charge. Wouldn't apply its power. Um, some more rocket launch. Some more plasma missiles. Okay. Same for the other side. No new heads, no new bodies, no new arms. We got some new legs. Ooh. The fancy legs. Uh, cool. Okay. Some new guns is cool. I kind of want to check out the back laser. We've got a lot of money, so why not? Okay. Attack power is way higher. Impact is way higher. Do, 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 do. Da, 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 da. Our weight goes up by quite a bit, but that's still within parameters. See with Ian load. Yeah, let's buy this and check it out. That's ex. Oh no, that was not that good. Okay. Um, AC assembly. Uh, this was back. Back right. Here we go. And then let's uh. Training or not training? We want a AC test to test out this gun. Um, we'll put an anime girl on his robot. It's a coward. Uh, da, 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 da. I mean, if you send me something to put on my mech, I can work on that for next stream. I'm probably gonna spend a lot more. Oh my god, where the fuck are you? Um, hello? Okay, whoops. Not a thing I can use with this guy. Until he's knocked down, but if he's knocked down... Be able to hit him for a lot of damage. AP at fifty percent. No, he still dodges. Okay, so this is not a good shoulder weapon for this machine. It requires too much charge up. If I get some different legs, I might be able to... Or a better generator, even, if I could just charge up faster. Okay. I'll keep the gun for now, but not, not something I'm going to check out right now. At least play Cheat or Yellow if you're going to go Transformers. It's time for... <laughs> uh, da -da 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 -da. You're not seeing me anime porn. All right, I, I will, I can, we've gone over this. I can put decals for whatever y'all want there. 
Um, I'm not chrome because I'm on... Actually, I should update the colors because we got to have the blue in there. Uh, color set. Can I copy this color set? And then just, like, fuck with it. Oh, I didn't want the core head to be all black. Whoops. Yes, and then I want to add... Yeah, support is going to be... A blue... I think it's, like, this blue? Yeah, there we go. There we go. So that's... 185, 185. Yes. Um, also, y'all asked for this. Just saying. Y'all demanded that I fuck around with colors and things now, so I'm doing it. giving me a headache. I don't hate the lines. I think those lines are too much. These lines are... No, those lines are way too much. Pluses are wild. I kind of like the, the 28 here. Leopard print robot? Which one is leopard print? None of these are leopard print. They're like camo. The flames, please. The flames just look weird. Like, they don't look like flames. This at least looks like a pattern, kind of. Can I fuck with the... Oh, okay, okay. Size. Okay. If I make them smaller... Uh... We go back to our pattern color. Color three is our 185. Okay, okay. All right, the small flames might be too much. The medium flames, I'm I like, okay. I'm, I'm here for this, I'm here for this. I wish I could like rotate the pattern of oh, weathering. We can get rid of some of this weathering. Uh, like we want a little bit, but not not that much. I think five is where I'm at for weathering. Uh, guy Fury from Alex. <laughs> it's absolutely horrible. I love it. Yeah, it's got the it's got the brand colors of the blue and the yellow. It's got flames, like chat has requested. Save edits and quit, okay. Now the real question is, okay, okay. This is us now. Um, okay, AC data. Oh, okay. Cool, okay, I've saved this paint job, hopefully with that, that's, okay, so yes. With image editor, I should be able to get custom decals if y'all send them to me. I will work on that in the future, but let's do some training. Intermediate support, assembling an AC. Uh, mercenary support, provide online pilot training and craft uh, training, so double trigger boosters, mobility, generate base. Okay, let's just check it out. <coughs> There's no cheer here, Max. We'll put my decals on. <laughs> Hey Matt, how's it going? Um, hey Ant, how's it going? My junior friend bloody war over cash and glory. My mission shows up in that. <laughs> uh, okay, hold to rapid fire both weapons. Yeah, this is this is not 
the machine I was just painting, by the way. This is one they just gave me because I'm doing training. I just want to say that real quick. Uh, this is Armored Core. It's the giant robot game that just came out. Um, I am piloting a giant robot. Mobility is a, of an AC. It's greatly influenced by its overall weight and type of boosters installed. This AC is suited with boosters that have a short quick boost reload time, which allows it to outpace enemies with consecutive quick boosts. Okay, so yes, my quick boost uses way less energy. That's... During installing your AC greatly influences the rest of the assembly. For the selection of usable parts, the basic performance of the AC. AC is equipped to generator priorities and capacity in order to allow extensive use of aerial maneuvers and quick boosts. Hold X to expand. Okay. This thing is meant to go fast. Gotta go fast. Uh, fire control system installed. The AC affects target tracking, close medium range, and missile lock on. The AC is with the FCS that is specialized with close range combat, allowing it to reliably attack with high fire power weapons. Use the left shoulder. Thing moves a lot faster. Kinda like it. Uh, da, 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 da. Anime girl robots in the max one turn on the anime girl mode. <laughs> I you need to send me post stream anime decals that I can put on my giant robot. That's what I'll do. Uh, Guargrula from the Hollow Life painted on when you're scoped gun arms. Metal Gear. He's playing the. Uh, yeah, I, I actually don't know any Metal Gear games at all. I'm, apologies for not getting that reference, Dr. Pockets. Oh, yes, I don't have access to the Discord while I'm playing the game. I even read that, read that tooltip now. Oh, this one's not dead yet. Whoops. Please die. I have a phone. That's true. I can look at it on my phone. Actually, my phone's not giving me Discord notifications right now, so I can't easily look at it right now. Uh, we got better boosters. We got a better FCS. A new generator. Cool. All right. How do these boosters compare to what I've got now? Okay, so way more thrust. A little bit less upward thrust. Upward ink consumption is decently worse. Uh, melee attack thrust. Uh, AD thrust is a lot higher. Ink consumption is not really a different. A little bit heavier, just not that much. Boost speed. Yeah, I like these boosters a lot. We're switching to that. FCS. Uh, I kind of want something that's more medium to long range, so I'm not going to take these because it's horrible at long range. Generator, though. This is just a better generator. Slightly heavier, but that's fine because we got a way higher EN output. No expansions yet. Okay. Uh, next training. Reverse training to ACs. Yes. Time to look at nerd numbers, but not his Discord. Yes. The nerd numbers are in the game still. Ooh, I've got, like, big ol' rockets. Okay. Reverse training leg units excel at jumping and also leverage their leg strength to improve quick bursts. Uh, boosts. Uh, these legs units are also capable of high jumps that do not consume EN, making it easier to achieve aerial retreats and shift aerial con. Interesting, okay. Uh, 
Left shoulder grenade cannon is AC fires. Explosive rounds are close area damage upon impact. Even using the weapon of this nature, you can exploit area damage to get effect fire to grab from aerial position. Yes. Oh, I do love grenade launchers. Charge weapons. Okay. Cool. Okay. Weapons fall into three categories depending on the type of damage they do. Kinetic explosive energy. Uh, the defensive performance of an AC and other craft varies for each of these damage types determining this. So, left hand, right hand. Uh, energy weapons produce heat when fired, and things an ultimate result in overheating. When overheated, weapon will be temporarily disabled, but function will regain once the weapon is allowed to cool. Avoid overheating. Uh, da -da, right hand weapon, hold it to charge attack. Ricocheting will occur when enemies have high defense and are reducing the damage they take. To counteract this, try attacking closer range or switch to an explosive weapon. Excuse me, a shoulder mounted grenade launcher, that'd be amazing. A laser handgun, that's it. That's it. I mean, that's that's valid, actually. So we got a machine gun, laser handgun, assault rifle, linear rifle. I still kind of like the AR. Uh, what else do we have for options to buy? Oh, we can buy the handgun. Okay, okay, cool. Um, basically, these let me jump better. Everything else is expected. Uh, chonky legs. I think I'm going to keep my legs. I really like... Um, quad legs from previous Armored Core games, so I'm kind of waiting on money to get quad legs. Uh, Liberation Front Fortress of the Wall, attack by using to assist the assault on the Rubicon Liberation Front Stronghold, destroy the Juggernaut Heavy Mobile Artillery Platform. Mid route run to V with friendly craft, extra rewards based on the number of enemies destroyed. Okay, cool. You like my thick boy legs? Thanks, thanks. Um, can you do fists? Uh, yeah, spidery legs are the, the quad legs. Um, I don't have any available yet, unfortunately, but I, I want some real bad. This is V2 Snare, leader of the Vesper Second Squad. I will chair the briefing for this mission. This is an operation of my own design. Consider it a privilege to be called to participate. You're an asshole, sir. You will be attacking the Wall, a key trading outpost fortified by the Rubicon Liberation Front. The rabble have formed a defensive line comprised of artillery and MT squads. Break through the line, then make your way to the top of the wall. There you shall find the Juggernaut, a mobile heavy artillery platform. Destroy it. 
Rusty. However, be aware that Balaam has also taken a crack at the wall, only for their vainglorious hopes to be dashed. Do try not to <coughs> Oh, Volta. He was one of the dudes that we were fighting with before. Our friend is dead. Uh, cool. Let's go. Sword may not be the thing that I need for this mission, but I'm gonna. I'm stick. I don't know. I like. I like gun and sword a lot. Show them you're worth the credits. Six, two, one. Fist covered with football pads. You look like a boss. <laughs> um, can someone check and see if there is a way to do, like just fists, or if you, the only way to do melee is swords? I actually don't know. Oh. Jeez. Well, I'm a die. Oh no, there's just a space down here. I might just live down here now. Also over here. Ow! Jeez. Would not have thought they could fire into this hole. Time to go onto a jump pad. Probably the one on the right. Ah, that's who shot me. Oh shit. There are a lot of enemies everywhere in this mission. I just want some breathing room. What the fuck are you? You record G4's last words. Video record extract from a wreck and complete message sent from one member of the Red Guns to another, apparently just before death. You guys, I'm telling you, man, you gotta give Michigan a chance. He's different from that suit, from the suits in HQ. Look, I know he's an asshole, but he's looking out for us, you know. Almost like we got a family here, huh? Man, if there's anyone who deserves punching out this, uh, it's the freaks who sent us on this suicide mission. You picked a good day to go away, AWOL. I wish I... All right.
Jeez. Jeez. Most tetrapod MT eliminated, but significantly reduces the threat in the city. Access the bulkhead and break into the wall. I am almost dead, and I got no more heals. Hopefully, I'm just safe at this door. <laughs> This game has lots of lore. Why would you accuse me of not paying attention to lore? Okay, I'm gonna check out it. Uh, why is the flavor down? <laughs> If it's not paying attention to law. <laughs> there should be a lift nearby. The okay. target is close. Just refill Estes flasks. I'm there's no bonfire yet. I but yes, essentially Estes flasks will refill. <clears throat> this game does have checkpoints though, so if I do I'm assuming a boss fight is coming up because this is a long elevator to lead to a thing. And they talked about a big big robot thing. Um, if I die, I get my, my heals back at least. I've dispatched a supply, Sherpa. Make sure oh. you resupply. Or I just get them back now. Fuck yes. I don't have to die for no reason. <laughs> Supplies replenished. Nice. Oh, love that. All right, Exxon Blast. <laughs> friend, I th hope. They said there was gonna be a friend here. You must be Raven. It's Rusty. One of the infamous handler Walter sounds. Uh, I already got bodied by tutorial boss, sir. This is like two hours into the game. The <laughs> We're past tutorial boss. <laughs> That's the juggernaut. Heavy mobile cannon. Jeez. I wouldn't recommend taking it head on. And it won't be able to keep up with steel hands. I'll distract it while you hit its blind spot. Watch out. Did not mean to use Mela there. Oh, still bad.
Oh, it's got. It's got mines Jeez, that's bad. Right, use the air. This thing doesn't fly. There goes all my heals. No, don't melee. That was bad and dumb. This went from a not so bad fight to a very bad fight very quickly. <laughs> Woof. All right. Be prepared for him to charge at me for no reason. <laughs> Jeez, he hits hard. Fuck. So fast, too. Ah, shit. No repair kits remaining.
fuck. <sighs> it's gonna be a bait and punish fight, right? Yeah. Uh, bye, drones. Thanks for popping in. It does not appear the army units are designed to punch. Yeah, that's that. That's kind of what I expected. That's the juggernaut, a heavy mobile cannon. Shit, where to go? Such good content, me just quietly, silently fighting this thing. <laughs> Missiles would have gotten it. the basic rule from games attack the butt dude you can only attack the butt on this thing <laughs>
but who am I? I don't know who I am. <laughs> Seen a clip of a Japanese player throwing down their guns and finishing off an airship with their fists, but that might have just been doing at least 1-2% to 2 damage. Damn. I gotta... Can, uh, Matt, can you post a link to that? Because that sounds cool. Uh, log on program progress. We got arms! Who are you? You're Jean Valjean. <laughs> More parts. What parts we got? Uh, ooh, a pulse gun. This looks buck wild for a gun. Uh, rapid fire pulse gun developed by Tagawa Harmonics. Uh, destroys targets with sustained high frequency oscillation, making it especially suited for canceling out pulse defenses, uh, which use the same technology. Okay. <clears throat> Wait, is this a different... So oh, it's a different sword. Okay. Uh, I might just buy that to just take a look at it later. Uh, the copy of that pulse gun. We've got homing missile launcher. A pulse buckler. It's a shield. We got that rocket launcher again. The new heads, the new arms. We got quad legs! Uh, pteropod legs, uh, parts built by Archibus, derived from the existing model, intended for tetrapods deploying alongside Archibus's bipedal and reverse jointed ACs. This model focuses on mobility to enable hovering based fire support. I am buying these. Tank treads also look legit, but I don't think I have enough, like, back armor things to make that worth it. Um, new thrusters. These are more for jumping. Can you require reload ideal weight? Uh, okay. So SES, some generators. Uh, this is just flat out better. It requires some more energy, but not by that much. The weight doesn't matter. EN load doesn't matter. I'm very close to my EN load though, so I need to be careful on that. Uh, Yeah, this is just a straight upgrade, though. I should just grab that. Okay. Assembly. Uh, FCS. Yeah, that's just worth it. Um, boosters, I'm still with those. No expansion slots. We're going quad legs. What are these arms? Ooh, they look kind of cool. I do have to move my cat again if I equip them, though. Uh, okay, so <laughs> that's a post speaker. All right, I will I will click on that later. That link. Uh, just look at your baby head spider from Toy Story. Uh, his sick flame. <laughs> uh, okay, let's look at these arms. Uh, more armor, more defenses. Melee specialization is down. Boost speed is down a little bit. Cube quick boost speed goes down. Attitude recovery. Some more defensive arms. Uh, do, 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 do. I don't think I want to use these yet. I think I'm content with these. I'm gonna stick with these arms for now. Um, what was the other thing I bought? I bought something else, didn't I? 
Oh, right, the sword. I wanted to compare the swords. Uh, tap power, a cumulative impact. So impact goes down, but damage goes up. I'm kind of okay with that. Charging is better. Da -da -da. Direct hit adjustment. That's fine. A little bit heavier. But my, again, my weight and everything is all fine. Let's try it out. Um, so we're gonna do a quick AC test. <clears throat> and then we'll do a training, and I might call it there since it's been two and a half hours, and, um... <sighs> I have Spoder. So it does... Okay, I can't do multiple hits with it. It's just a single slash. What is the charge of attack on it? Ooh! That's a fun charge attack. Okay, let's quit this test for now. This seems cool. How can you sleep when there's robots? Uh... <laughs> it's not that I'm sleepy and don't want to play more of the game it's that oh, okay i'm gonna okay i'll learn how to use these legs real quick um i just don't want to be on camera for that much longer <laughs> terrible losing a high load at capacity enable ac build with heavy multiple uh multiple heavy weapons terrified acs can switch to hover mode after ascending uh, off the ground, allow them to remain suspended in the air for some time. Interesting. Okay. Oh, sick. Yo, I'm just like hovering forever. This is great. Okay. Short attacks and fire from heavy weapons such as grenade launchers cause more recoil than other attacks, forcing the AC to assume a firing stance. Tetrapods are capable of absorbing this kind of recoil at royal. These attacks to be executed during movement. So I can just fly when doing all this shit. <laughs> oh my god, I love this hover. <coughs> uh, hover is you to maintain altitude and turn making it easier to establish a line of fire and lock on without geographical obstruction uh yep cool that's just hovering tactics i've, I've been doing that game does mean that I am more likely to get hit though, because I do dumb things. Cool. <clears throat> Grenade launcher, all right, cool, cool, cool. And then training on tank ACs.
Technical units are heavily armored and boast excellent loading capacity. In addition to loading, uh, lending themselves to high durable builds, they are also good candidates for high firepower assemblies. Tank type ACs are capable of absorbing recoil, which allows them to fire heavy weapons without entering a firing stance. Um, rapid fire both weapons. Yeah, yeah. Hemisines can drift quickly, change their direction they are facing. Attack suit groups move left, uh, left stick in a direction you want to face, immediately hit circle or. Uh... Boost movement on. Guns overheated. That's not allowed. Cool. <coughs> Vertical missile launchers. New exercise added training. All right, we got more training. Advanced murder scenario certification. Pure simulation advanced murder certification. For all mine, simply your own AC and complete the evaluation. Sure. <clears throat> yeah, I was thinking that I'd finish chapter one, but I guess chapter one is a little bit longer than I was expecting. Uh, during real mission, you can expect enemy reinforcements and other changes to the situation. It has to advance mercenaries, their ability to adjust to the wide range of combat scenarios, and adapt to the AC to meet the needs of the mission. Cool. Oh shit.
Whew, okay. Is that everything? Let's go. Alright. Communal training programs. Sick. Alright, alright. <clears throat> Ooh, okay. Congratulations on your certification. You have proven your skills by completing the entire combat training regimen. Registration number RB23. Call sign Raven. All mind anticipates excellent performance. Keep it, all right. Advanced mercenary, sick. Uh, cool. when do I get access to the arena? That's what I really want to know. Um, what did I get? Oh, right, I got this grenade launcher. Fuck yeah. I still want a sword for now, though. Uh, oh, and a back piece. I'll stick with these for now. Happy with my quad legs, happy with my boosters, happy with my FCS. My generator's fine. Still don't know what goes in expansion. Um, oh, we can buy new stuff, though. Part shop, buy. Oh, bazooka for right hand. Cool. Oh, sorry, grenade launcher for right hand. We already had a bazooka option. Oh, and there's other new parts. Oh, right, the other side of that. Yup. Cool, cool, cool. Sick, okay. Um, we got two missions coming up, Retrieve Combat Logs and Balls Arsenal number two, but we will hit those at a later date. Um, <clears throat> thanks everyone for joining. It's very true, nothing can go wrong with a uh, grenade launcher. Grenade launchers and bazookas are some of my favorite weapon, like just have a big old boom and then a melee and just go ham. It's one of my favorite things to do with uh, armor core builds. But either way, thanks everyone for joining. Um, I'll be back tomorrow morning with probably more deck builders because I kind of like doing the Friday morning deck builder stuff. Um, I might do some Armored Core in the afternoon or I might just play Armored Core on my own, TBD. Um, this game's a lot of fun. I highly recommend it from what I've been having. I've been having a blast so far. Um, I don't know if y'all have, have, have realized that yet or not, but I love these games. I like the little trickle of lore from just listening to people talk over comms about stuff. It's good. It's good. Um, but yeah, um, I'll catch you all tomorrow. Um, until next time, stay safe, stay sane, stay healthy. Bye, y'all.